um, Nippon Aesthetic Solutions. So I'm here today to to share to everyone the importance of hygiene and makeup application and in skincare cleansing. But what I wanted to really share to you is our star product, which is the Nippon Cosmetic Wedge Sponges. Firstly, uh, Nippon, as I said, uh, we specialize in a lot of um, hygiene tools that probably you would see being used in salons or being used by professional makeup artists or even beauty enthusiasts. So what makes our wedge sponges different from the others that you see out there? Firstly, for the shape, I'll open one for you now so that you get to see what's inside. The shape is really of a wedge, so it's basically like a, a, a triangular sponge. Tip portion would be wider than the other tip, so it can definitely reach the areas where we feel it's not very easy to reach. Or which areas are these? Probably your, the crease near your nose, or the edges near your ears, or the lip area. So this one can be folded, it can be wedged into the different areas when we put applicate uh, when we use powder or when we use foundation. So definitely this is a tool that every makeup artist would dream of having in their kit. So I guess as a beauty enthusiast, if you want to replicate the makeup that your favorite makeup artists um, were able to do onto you, you would also want to have this on your kit. So even if you travel, you can uh, squeeze in a couple of pieces in your Kikai kit and you're ready to go. As I mentioned also that these are disposable tools, of course we highly recommend that we are able to to clean or um, perhaps dispose of these products when it's already not very nice to see because of course the foundation will be there. We do not want uh, the bacteria or the germs to really stick on because um, the beautiful faces that you have is something that we really invest on. I'm sure that everyone here would be able to start by cleansing their faces, right? So when we do clean our faces, of course we also want that the inner portions of our skin are clean by being able to dispose of very used um, uh, disposable sponges. So for our product, uh, other product, we have the micro precision tips. This is actually a, a best kept secret. As I would always say because firstly the size itself is very thin as compared to your typical um, dual cotton tips or perhaps cotton buds so just to prove how thin they are I'd like to show that look at these cute babies they're very thin they're very tiny ergo the name micro precision tips uh, we are very happy and proud actually to say that we are the only company who would really have these tiny babies. Look how tiny it is. One end is round and one end is pointy. So of course, when you are doing your very tricky eye makeup, this is the perfect tool because the pointy end will be able to take away um, some of the excess makeup in your smoky eye look perhaps. Or when you are trying on to be a bit more creative, when you are using falsies or false eyelashes, this one can help you put it up a bit with your eyelids. So this is why they say this is such a power product. Uh, I think to use it is to really believe. We also exclusively carry Korean Spirit Professional Brush Cleaner, as you can see here. So basically, we have different sizes of the Korean Spirit Professional Makeup Brush Cleaner. It's the perfect um, complementary product, I would say, to a lot of those makeup artists or beauty enthusiasts who have started investing in really good makeup brushes. Let's make this more fun in taking care of your brushes by using the Korean Spirit Professional Makeup Brush Cleaner. With all the sizes that you would see here, I would suggest that for those who are just starting out in taking care of their brushes, you can probably start with a small um, with a small bottle to just see how it goes for you. For today, I would want to discuss the use of the professional makeup brush cleaner wipe. So I'd like to open one pack for you just to see what's inside. So of course, what comes out is a mini sheet. So if you'll notice that this particular sheet is infused with lemon scent, but at the 
the same time, the solution is good to go when you are traveling or perhaps if you are a makeup artist and you have an outside shoot, this is the perfect tool for you. So doing this, swishing it back and forth until the color comes off onto the white. Why did I mention uh, general cleaning? Basically, if you will notice here, we have the spray. So sometimes, um, for those people who are uh, who lead a more active lifestyle, what they do is they spray their brushes this way. So just a couple of um, spritz, and then they can use uh, facial tissue perhaps to whisk off the color as well. But for the general cleaning portion, we have what you call the Perian Spirit Dipping Jar or Glass Canister for other people. So it's a glass jar and it comes with two plastic um, components. One is like a, a potato chip looking chi uh, flat disc and one is like a, a, a plastic ring that you can put your plastic chip on top of. So it goes this way. So basically when we are able to see inside, you put the solution inside, just enough so that you can cover your brush hair or up to where the color usually settles. Then you swish it this way. After swishing, you will notice that the color will settle. Then you will know that you were able to generally clean your brushes. So basically, um, you can, as I said, what are the tools that you can use for makeup brush cleaning? You can use um, the wipe or you can use your facial tissue. Or you can use also use um, like we have like a facial cotton cloth, so it's actually a replication of this one. It's just that this one is not soaked in the Perian Spirit solution. So basically, uh, once again, I'd like to invite everyone to start fresh, start clean, and live a healthy, beautiful lifestyle when it comes to makeup hygiene.